Hello, you are welcome how to solve for x in this nice algebra problem. From here, we have x raised to the power x minus 1 equals to square root of 2 raised to the power x. And then from the law of indices, when we have a raised to the power m minus n, this can be written as a raised to the power m divided by a raised to the power n. And when we apply that here, on the left hand side, we can write this as x raised to power x over x raised to power 1. Now equals to square root of 2, that's root 2 raised to power x. Then here, let's remove this 2 raised to power x on this side. That is, we multiply by 1 over root 2 raised to power x and also we multiply this side by 1 over root 2 raised to power x that is whatever we do to one side we do it to the other side from here this cancel out then on this side we can equally separate this and write it as x raised to power x then over since this, this multiply we have root 2 raised to power x then times 1 over x, x raised to power 1 is tx, which is equal to 1 left on this side. Then from here, we have same power here. Then we can bring everything inside and take the power out. And this will give us x over root 2 to the power of x from the law of indices. Then multiply by 1 over x equals to 1. Also, let's remove this 1 over x here. And uh, that means we multiply both sides by x. So when we multiply this by x, it will cancel out. So multiply this side by x and also multiply this side by x. And this cancel each other. Then we are left with x over root 2. Then all raised to power x, which is equal to x on this side. Then also in the next step, let's get rid of this power of x and multiply both power by 1 over x. When I multiply this side by 1 over x, since this power multiply x, x will cancel x. And we also multiply this power as well by 1 over x. Then this x has cancelled this x, then we are left with x over root 2, which is now equals to x raised to power 1 over x. Then also in the next step, we can remove this x here and divide both sides by x, same thing as multiply both sides by 1 over x. Then multiply this side 2 by 1 over x, such that x will still cancel x here. Then this side remain 1 over root 2, which is equal to here. This multiply, we can write it as x raised to power 1 over x, then over x. Then from here, we have this sort, which we can rationalize, and uh, this will be times root 2. Then over root 2, when we rationalize this, then 1 times root 2, that's root 2. Then root 2 times root 2, that will give us 2, that's root 2 over 2 there, which is equal to x raised to power 1 over x, then all over x. And also from here, two, root 2 here can be written as 2 raised to power half, because square roots can be written as power of half, then over 2 which is equal to x raised to power 1 over x over x. When we look at this pattern here, we have the same number here. We have it as the denominator of the fraction here. And same thing here, this x is the same thing as the denominator of this you know, fraction. And uh, the denominator of the whole fraction here is the same thing as you know, those, two, those numbers. Same thing here, we have x as the denominator here. And from here, we can therefore conclude that x will be equal to 2. So here, we have the value of x 
to be equal to 2. And when we check from the equation given to us, from the question, we have x raised to power x minus 1, then equals to root 2 raised to power x. When we check that from here, we have x equals to 2. We got x to be equal to 2. So let's put it there. Then from there, we have x raised to power 2 minus 1. x is 2. So we have 2 raised to power 2 minus 1. If this equals to square root of 2 raised to power 2. And when we check, we have 2 minus 1 here is 1. That's 2 raised to power 1 is equals to square we cancel square root here equals to 2 of course 2 raised to power 1 is still 2 which is equals to 2 left hand side equals to the right hand side and therefore we have the value of x in this our problem to be equals to 2 thank you for watching please share this video subscribe to this channel and turn the notification bell on see you next class and bye for now